the man, the myth, the legend. Gilbert Newton Lewis founded chemical bonding at the year 1916 along with his Lewis electron dot structure which represents the number of valence electrons in a single atom. He also invented the octet rule which states that an atom is complete if the number of valence electrons is 8. Lewis outlined concepts of bonding that are still used today. In this level of experiment, oil is the nonpolar compound, baking soda is the ionic compound, and vinegar is the polar compound. The oil and the vinegar don't mix because oil has larger density than the vinegar. Aside from that, nonpolar compounds don't mix with polar liquids. We are now comparing the two chemical bonds and give them some example. Firstly, we have the ionic bonding. It refers to the transfers of electrons between the metal and the metal elements. It also results to the positively charged cation and negatively charged anion. An example of this ionic product is the batteries. It consists of lithium iodide which is made up of metal and the metal elements respectively. Next is the covalent bonding. It refers to the bonding of two non-metal elements and has two types the polar and then polar covalent. An example of this covalent product is the body scrub. It is a hand spy equipment which is made up of sugar that consists of three non-metal elements. We may not say it directly or literally, but chemical bonding applies greatly in our everyday life. We use it for the lyrics that we drink, up to the vitamins that we take, and it's also the reason why we have modern day medicine. It connects our body cells and it has countless benefits in our society.